Okay, before we go into the outros, I've just done a video about the intros. You can see here, I opened a whole bunch of tabs and there's a whole bunch of these um, templates within Canva that's basically saying things like, welcome to my channel. And all I did was remove anything that was kind of personalized and kept it very, very gener generic. And you can see within about five minutes, I've got, I don't know how many here, we got about 20 or so different intros. And all we have to do is click on save and they just keep adding, okay? But um, in this video, I wanna show you how we can do the outro because if I type in here, YouTube outro, and I put a comma and I can put in here something like, thanks, okay? Then we're probably gonna get a whole bunch back that says, thanks for watching, okay? And all we have to do, open in a new window, open in a new window, and you can see that we're gonna have a bunch of these that we can use for outros and it's the same process, okay? Just go and open a whole bunch of these and then click to save. So if I go into one of these, all I have to do is click up here for share, click on here for download and click on download. And now when you see this, you can see that it's ready, okay? It's ready to um, render and then it's gonna save it to whatever folder you want. So you wanna have a folder for your intros, you wanna have a folder for your outros so that when you're using the software, you're able to um, create these different sizes if of video sizes as far as like how many um, megabytes etc it is and the length of the videos as well so every video can be different if you've got a lot of options okay so five minutes work you can have 20 30 intros and again five minutes work you can have 20 30 outros okay now the outros as well what you can do is you can put some call to actions in there okay so what we can do then instead of just taking these generic ones we can go um here and we can put thanks for watching hold on a second is that an intro or an outro that one is an outro. Let me just create a new folder. Outro's MP4, because we can do this as well um, with images. Okay, you can actually just do call to action images. There we go. Thanks for watching, subscribe. Okay, so that one is okay for, for exactly that. At least you got some kind of a call to action in there. Um, and you can do something better. You can say to them, like, um, click on the link in the description, or you can tell them, get the free gift in the description, or you can tell them, go and visit some um, video that's linked to in, in, in the description, or subscribe to my channel, or whatever you want. You can make all this, um, a list of these, and quite quickly within a couple of minutes and just go and do variations of it, even using the same template and saving again, because it's always going to be a different outro that you've got there. Okay. If you want to do that, but better that you just go and have a bunch of these ready so that the purpose of what we're doing with the chips indication, if you're using just one um, outro and one, uh, sorry, if you're just using one video and you need to have different sizes because you're putting that same video into multiple channels, then you really want to have um, a bunch of these and it's quick and easy to do, okay?